Hey guys, um, well my friend has been telling me, hey, go to this website, it's scary, make a reaction, so I'm like, okay, I will. so, alright, so this is what it's called, I don't know what this is, this is Bang Chan Dan Ghost, right, it's Korean, I guess, this is, Warning, this webtoon is a special order episode for the summer season. Since it contains shocking scenes, reader discretion is advised for pregnant women, the elderly, and those suffering from serious medical conditions. Okay, so let's do this. Mystery Sketch 2011. Bong Chon Dong Dose. Written and illustrated by Rong. The story is based on true eyewitness accounts. It was at around 11.20 that night. I was dragging myself home as I said after a tiring night study session at school, but there was no one on the street, which I thought was strange. I usually, I usually see a lot of people even at night, since my apartment complex is pretty big. Anyways, feeling scared, I kept looking down on the ground while walking home. Suddenly, a shadow stretching towards me caught my eyes, although there wasn't anyone around me. I looked up to see who there was. I saw a woman walking in front of me, but she looked a little strange. I could say that she looked crippled. She was limping and struggling to walk in front of me. Dang, dude, look at that. Since she was walking very slow, I soon caught up with her. Up close, I was able to see her even better. She was wearing dirty pink pajamas and looked as if all her joints in her body had been twisted. Where's her hair? was a mess and sticking out to everywhere. Did she worry about her hair? What the heck? It seemed so weird that I stopped walking. I felt like I shouldn't get any closer to her, nor did I have the guts to pass her by. <laughs> what the heck, man? Ugh. Ugh. That was scary, guys. Oh. Alright. <laughs> oh, okay. You know people say that you're really surprised you can't even scream. That was right. I froze there. Not being able to move at all. Where's my baby? My thoughts were racing to her question. Oh my god. I don't even know what I was thinking when I did that. Give me chills. Thinking that moment. Go. Cool. I don't know what she's doing with that hair. I answered pointing as far as I could. Oh, over there. I just wanted her to get away from me. Then she limped towards where I had pointed to. And I couldn't see her anymore. Walking. Fearing that I might run into her again, I tried to turn around and leave that apartment complex. I could not think of anything but to get to a place where there would be people around at that moment. She is not here. I heard her screaming from her. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my, that's scary. Oh, I don't remember anything from then on. I heard that my neighbor finally passed out on the ground and took me home. 2007, an apartment complex in Bong Chan Dong, Guanakagu, Seoul. A 33-year-old woman jumped off the apartment and died on the spot. Known as surname Cho, divorcee due to her extramarital affair, she had lost her custody of her two-year-old daughter and decided to commit suicide. After that incident, Cho had, was seen walking around the apartment complex several times. After that incident, Choa was seen walking around that apartment complex several times. Dang, dude. It's sad. Oh my gosh, that was scary. I can't believe that. Oh. Probably even scarier than Amnesia, man. Oh. Well then. Ah. Uh, you guys, you want to see this? You got it. Alright. So if you guys want me to do anything, I don't know, 
Maybe some more stories, I guess. I don't know. Just send me a link to something, and I'll do it. All right. Let's subscribe.